lot of guys like to, um, obviously, normally you mix this in a cup with a drink, but I'm lazy. How do you do it like that? Don't do that at home. Where are you now? At home. <laughs> but I'm a professional. <laughs> You're a professional? I'm a professional at this. I've been doing it for years. I've mastered it. Oh, dear. <laughs> Don't do it at home. Use a cup of water. <laughs> uh, whoa, how many weeks are we? We are three. officially Less just three. one day. I mean, if if we're talking about Saturday finals, that's three weeks. Yeah. If we're talking about Friday pre-judging, that's three weeks minus one day. So we're three weeks up from the Arnold Classic. We're 20 days up from the Arnold Classic. Oh, yeah, 20 days. That sounds that sounds better. 20 days. But yeah, got a chess, half a chess session to do, do today. And uh, yeah, we're going to get it done. I'm filming my boy Anthony. And Mel is here too. Thomas behind the camera, leaning all the support. Yeah, let's get it. I'm just stalling right now, waiting for the machines to become free. But whilst we're here, uh, yeah. What do you think of Anthony's new hat? <laughs> he asked me, he asked me, or guess how much it was. I said five pounds. It was actually eight pounds. Three. three. Oh, three pounds. Oh, three pounds. Three pounds. Wow, you're a bargain. You said two pounds on that one. Pounds. Mm, yeah, you can tell him where you bought it from. He's gonna Primark, Primark. Oh, Primark. Looks Primark. Primark. <laughs> <laughs> he looks Primark. It fit my head, it fit my head, so I'm glad. Oh, yeah. He's nice to hear how that fits, yeah. right? Yeah. Why don't you ask, um, you can give me one of the whole side of the books. Yeah. Yeah, I got a few. Yeah. Because <laughs> one day I went to the camp. <laughs> there's, a, there's a shop in town just yeah. for hats, right? So there was one hat that fit my head out of like a hundred. Oh, freak it out. Yeah, it didn't fit my head. I swear, it didn't fit my head. There was one, I promise. Really? I got big head. I got big head. I got big head. Exactly. Like, like, I think this one is both have big head. Substance is bigger, but in Brazil, my head is big. Exactly. So, exactly. so I can find a hat like. Yeah, yeah. how come he's got like 20 hats and they all... Because, hostile, because America's hats fit differently. America's yeah. hats fit like oh. proper hats. Yeah. UK, they're a bit on the size. I think people in the UK have small heads. UK, 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 it's for smaller heads. Smaller heads, heads. yeah. <laughs> smaller heads. <laughs> all right, we got all this free. Let's go, let's go. Yeah. Let's get, get going, man. Let's start. Oh, calf time. Let's go. Oh. I need a holiday. All right, I definitely need a holiday. Are you having one? I'm having a holiday. Do you actually have one book? Yeah, <laughs> I actually have a holiday book this time. So, yeah, I ain't gonna say where. But somewhere nice. A lot of blue sea, a mountain. Yeah. And all you can eat. And I ain't gonna do anything for four days. Just rest, chill. All right. Hey. Okay, let's do this. Yeah, let's see how you do on the pressure. Oh. Tip when you're training calves, and I know this. Just when you're doing standing calf raises, a lot of guys get this wrong. They tend to put a lot of weight in there and they just go up and down. They think, oh, I can lift a lot heavier. So I'm just gonna stack it up and go up and down. The idea of it is this you're not trying to get your calf going up and down, you're trying to get your heel to go forward. So you want up and forward, and that requires you bending your knees. Keep the knees bent. Now focus the tough focus so try to get your heel up. Try to get your heel to come up as an arch that way. So you're going more forward and now, you know. So when you kind of focus get your heel to doing that, you get a lot more contraction in your calf and a lot more speed to it. And you realize you can't lift as heavy when you do it that way.
higher power in this coalition. We just turned the field into a demolition. It was desolate, but I had premonition. I was training for war every exhibition, every extra mission, every enemy listening. Get off my dick, I got bad intentions. Make it right every wrong, and I'm back with a vengeance. I show you the ropes. Beast in my town, I can show you the coast. Up in the shots if they wanted to smoke. If you know, then you know. Suit it up, bitch, my whole team do the same. Don't you forget who created the game. Ready for war, I was born. When it comes to bodybuilding, you gotta understand. You because you're lifting heavy, don't mean you're training hard. The idea is you're trying to break down your muscle as alone, and to use nothing but that muscle that you're using to move the movement work. So putting a lot of weight on the bar and doing all you can to just move it doesn't mean that you're putting your maximum effort into that muscle that you're actually training. Bring the weights down, think about it, think about contracting that muscle, contracting that movement, and isolating just that movement itself that makes that muscle work. And you realize you, don't, <laughs> you can't lift as heavy as much as you can when you put all the tension into one single muscle. It, it's so painful when you do that and slow that movement down and just focus all your effort onto just that muscle alone. You won't, you won't require a lot of weight to do so, you know. So he's trying to know the difference between, okay, I'm lifting heavy, and I think I'm training hard by lifting heavy, to no, I'm actually working a muscle in spite of body dude. Now, if you're power lifting, that's a little different ball game.
sets so three fast one slow three fast one slow three fast one slow so
Ay.
guys so we're back home from training and yeah that was a good session and it's a hard session we're both feeling it because we're both in prep Anthony is uh how many weeks is it six now I've been six weeks out I'm three so yeah exhausted back home about to have our post gym meal and chill out we're having our what's left over of the intro work sipping it now <laughs> just enjoying that but guys man chest session is in chest and calf session is in two weeks out from the old, um, Arnold classic and yeah man Another video, another week, getting closer, and yeah, things like the way things are turning out, like the way things are looking. And yeah, we'll catch you guys next week for another episode of Road to the Olymp Road to the Arnold. So, guys, we're gonna catch you guys next time. Take it easy, and catch you on the next one. Bye.